When priming a substrate, a new one or one that you've used before, the substrate should always be tested for priming performance. Begin by applying indicator solution to the prime substrate. Apply the solution across the substrate and also a slightly heavier drop. The line will turn yellow to indicate that primer is present. The drop will help in determining the coat weight and should turn yellow in about 12 seconds. The lower the coat weight, the longer the drop will take to turn yellow. Once you know that primer is present, perform a tape test. Using 3M 230 tape for paper or 3M 810 for film, apply a piece of tape to a freshly primed piece of substrate hot off the press. Using a 2 kg roller, roll over the tape back and forth two times. Let it dwell for about five minutes. Then remove the tape at a 45 degree angle. Next, apply indicator solution in a line across the substrate, including the area that was covered by the tape. If the indicator solution turns yellow, the substrate is ready for production. If the area where the tape was removed remains blue, the primer has not cured and was removed by the tape. Perform the same test at 30 minutes and at 60 minutes if necessary. If at any point the indicator solution does not remain blue in an area, the primer has fully cured. If after the test at 60 minutes, the indicator solution still remains blue, refer back to the checklist to make sure that everything was correct, for example, nothing past its expiration date. If the substrate was corona treated, check the corona treater to make sure it is working properly. Make sure the drying unit is working correctly. Check to see if the wrong analox roller was used, resulting in a coat weight that is too high. Determine if the analox roller is clogged. 